breaking news of a deadly shooting tonight at the Enterprise Walmart. Good evening, I'm Amanda Arnold. Thank you for joining us. One person has died from that shooting and police say they have someone in custody. WDHN's Aaron Dixon has been at the scene now for some time, gathering the latest. He joins us now with what we can confirm for you so far. Aaron? Amanda, I'm on the scene of the Walmart in Enterprise in what was called in as an active shooter situation, but that's not what police are calling it. They say it was an argument between two men in the parking lot that escalated into the Walmart. Now, the call came in around 730, and when police arrived, they found a white deceased male with multiple gunshot wounds, but police say they have a suspect in custody. Police say the argument started in the parking lot and continued into the store near the pharmacy area of Walmart where the shooting take place, they said multiple shots were fired and the shooter used a handgun. The argument was between two males and an individual sources are telling WDHN that the victim was a father of three, but police are unable to confirm that at this time. Now, police are still on scene as I am seeing around 11 cop cars. Police cannot confirm that people were held in the store so that police could interview eyewitnesses. Police gave us an update within the last hour. Um, the initial call was there was an active shooter uh, that turned out not to be the case. Um, we, when we responded, uh, we located a deceased white male and um, uh, the suspect or the shooter was taken into custody. Now, Hagelin also adds that no other injuries were reported to them and that more information will be available in the morning as they will be holding a press conference. So stick with WDHN as we continue to follow this case as it is still an active investigation. In Enterprise, Aaron Dixon, WDHN News for The Wiregrass.